Monoclonal antibody preparations contain only one type of antibody derived from a single cloned B cell. Consequently, they are highly specific for a single epitope and have applications, for example, in diagnostic microbiology and cancer therapy. The first step in producing a monoclonal antibody is to inject an animal with an antigen containing the specific epitope of interest. Each B cell produces a single type of antibody. B cells are isolated from the spleen and then mixed with myeloma cells, a type of cancer cell that grows continuously. Addition of polyethylene glycol causes the two types of cells to fuse together to form cells called hybridomas. The mixture of B cells, myeloma cells, and hybridomas are cultured under conditions which permit growth of only the hybridoma cells. Each hybridoma cell will produce a single type of antibody against a single epitope. The single hybridoma cells are then separated into individual wells of a microtiter plate and tested for ability to produce the desired antibody. The hybridoma cells producing the desired monoclonal antibody are then cultured. Monoclonal antibodies are isolated and purified.